Barrel having a big impact on the Gulf, Co Gulf Coast, but uh, Marissa, as we kind of touched upon last evening, this storm could have implications here in the Midwest. Yeah, and especially because there has been a kind of change in the track by the time it gets near us, it's no longer looking like it's going to stay in the Ohio River Valley, but actually kind of push into Michigan as we get into Wednesday. So we could be looking at some steady rain coming in our direction, but right now here is a look at Tropical Storm Barrel on infrared satellite imagery. Sustained winds are 65 miles per hour, so it is again still a tropical storm. It is expected to intensify within about the next 10 hours before it does make landfall early in the morning tomorrow. So we're looking at about 2 a.m. with the potential landfall as a category one storm. So we'll keep an eye on this system, of course, not only after it makes landfall, but as we take a look at about Wednesday, that's when the track does kind of move right into our region, at least the latest uh, possibility. And that likely means we'll see at least some steady rain across the region, not as much as what they are going to have over towards Texas and Louisiana, eventually into Arkansas, but we could get at least a decent amount. But let's zoom in and what's going on right now. Showers and storms are firing along a front well off to our west. I'm not worried about those for tonight or even into the first part of the day tomorrow, but we do have a chance for some showers and maybe a few thunderstorms coming in tomorrow evening. Right now, though, we have a nice quiet evening, mostly clear skies, just some cumulus clouds out there to round out your day. But as we continue overnight tonight, we'll have a few clouds push through by tomorrow morning, going mostly sunny to partly cloudy across the region with rain just off to our northwest. But as we progress throughout the afternoon, we'll see a couple more clouds still mostly dry, but but once we get towards the evening, that's when we're going to have a better chance for some spotty showers and thunderstorms. Best chance will be after about four o'clock tomorrow, all the way through about 11 o'clock. Again, spotty showers and maybe a thunderstorm or two. As of right now, it doesn't look to be severe, but we do have some heat in place and maybe a little bit of humidity that we could see some stronger cells. But with the cloud cover ahead of the shower chances, that should limit our chance for severe storms. But still be weather aware for the remainder of the day tomorrow. As we take a look, Look at our temperatures tonight. We're into the mid to upper 60s as we get into tomorrow afternoon. Warmer than today. More of us will be into the mid 80s and a few of us climbing into the upper 80s as we get towards the afternoon. But we move into Tuesday. Our temperatures are back down into the mid 80s, upper 70s on Wednesday. Again, this is when we're looking at the chance for some of that moisture to move in from what is now Tropical Storm Barrel. It's likely going to be at least a rainy Wednesday with showers wrapping up on Thursday and eventually ending. But we will keep a couple more shower chances into the weekend. Darren. All right, thanks.